So, hello guys and welcome back to another Dreams playthrough. So this time, um, I'm going to be featuring Adventure Time Stuck in the Universe because um, the um, creator Johnny plays underscore YT um, requested this. So I'm going to be obviously featuring this on my channel and seeing what this is about. Um, it seems like a very interesting creation. It's made by three others as well. Um, who I'll also mention in the description and we are again going to jump straight into this Stuck in the Universe, it's a pretty cool title screen I like all the effects and the sound that sword is pretty impressive so maybe we should look at the controls first jam, double jam, attack, crouch, enjoy seems Pretty simple. Here's my imp. I should customize my imp one day. Wow, I like his visuals. I like his visuals. It has good effects. Pretty snazzy music too. Um, I will admit already that I'm not really a veteran of Adventure Time. I don't really know the characters too well, I haven't really watched it that much, but definitely doesn't stop me from appreciating this great creation and hopefully you can too. Okay, so we can go inside. So like a treasure. That's pretty cool. A throw punch. It's got a good control scheme. Um, attack combo. You can get the sword out, and then you can attack with a sword, which is pretty cool. And you can even, yeah, change his facial expression. Ah, press R1 to play a mini game. Oh no, let's go back. Oh, this is very cool. So it's a top down, kind of 8 bit inspired game. It's pretty impressive. I like the music in this as well. It's kind of loud though, but yeah. Getting over the spikes though, this is an experience, an experience that I like. So I swear that that spike actually penetrates and goes slightly through the barrel. I'm not sure whether that means it can actually touch you. I don't think it does, in fact, fortunately. But just the same, it's still very difficult to get over this because you have to time and jump well. There you go. It's actually it's not too hard once you practice a bit. Okay. There you go. There. We have to judge that right because we are actually technically it's technically this is like a 2.5D game because you can still like move on the axis. There you go. Oh, burning tire ring or people. Oh gosh, slapped straight into it. I managed to survive the impact. That was a fun mini game as well. It's impressive. Um, okay, let's go back out now. Sit down and listen to music. Yeah, we haven't done that yet. I'm the real Slim Shady by Eminem. You can even clap and there's a siphon. I think that's like a 5S or 5, one of the older iPhones, but uh, not everyone can afford to upgrade to the latest iPhones, me included. <laughs> oh, really? I'm just scared about copyright now. If this. 
I mean, it, it has doesn't have a lyrics, but <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but at the same time, I caught an idea lemon because I want to listen to it because it's a good song. <laughs> yeah, that's um. This is another really good reason to play the stream. That you could just <sighs> sit down and listen to the songs in it. Or right, even gangster. Might happen. But that's impressive. Um. Let me just look at the map to see whether I've missed anything. Oh, how did I like not get to those areas? This is a complex stream. This is impressive. Um Let's see what this is about. This is Ice Kingdom. Where does this lead? Oh, it's this. Hello? Hiya! And this is a, a piece of candy that's serving up milk and Oreos. <laughs> okay. Where are we now? Okay, this is Candy Town. Ooh, Jay, he just farted. This is another impressive world in this location. Yeah. Can you go into any of the houses, I wonder? Uh, maybe not. We might just need to go outside that front door. Okay. Now I've got some cool platforming. Um, need to jump onto the candy cane cookies. Okay. So yeah. Okay, so we're back to the hub world. I'll call it. Oh yeah, I can kind of see, like, it is kind of connected with the backgrounds. So can you actually like walk up to there and activate a trigger zone? Also, I must say I didn't notice that, but that's a really cool double jump animation. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, so anyone playing the dream, don't make the same mistake as me. You can get to the other worlds by. And I'm going the other way now, I think. You can get to the other worlds from the hub. I think maybe somewhere to improve would be to make it slightly more obvious and maybe link it to a story. Um, however, it's still very impressive. But anyway, I think that is just about going to cover it for the stream. It's very um, entertaining. I'll definitely be following Dream and the creation. I definitely uh, recommend you to try this out, especially if you're a fan of. Um, Adventure Time. There's a lot to like about it. The uh, graphics are nice and clean. The music's cool. The 8-bit mini games is very inventive, and the worlds are um, entertaining to explore. Um, and the controls are very um, good as well. I'd say that this um, has a lot of potential to be become even better as well. So definitely, very impressive creation. So I think that'll conclude that for this video. And don't forget to again like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed it. And uh, my next video should be tomorrow. And I'm planning to cover the new update that's recently come to Dreams, which is quite exciting, and the new um, Final Garden pack that's been released by Meteor Molecule. I definitely plan to um, cover that. So don't forget to support this video, and I'll see you in the next one.